Okay, if I'm right, this package from Infinite Product Solutions contains not a prototype, but a custom-made thread adapter for a Smith & Wesson M&P 1522 rifle with a smooth barrel. Uh, if I'm wrong, then it contains something else. But whatever it is, it came from Infinite Product Solutions, and we're going to open this next on Mostly 22LR. Hey everybody, Rob Rosenberger here for Mostly 22 LR. A couple of weeks ago I was dealing with the folks at Infinite Product Solutions asking them about the Smith & Wesson M&P 1522 with the smooth barrel end. And uh, they said, yeah, if you can give us some measurements, we can make you a custom barrel end for it. And although we didn't say anything about it, I'm sure that they want me to test this bad boy. And if I like it, they'll probably put it into production. Hopefully I got my measurements right. <laughs> Remember, measure twice, order once. So let's go ahead and open this. I like this packaging. Uh, it's very simple. Uh, it's it's uh, easy to work with. It's, it, it's uh, very lightweight. They only charge like uh, 3 or $4. dollars i am just going to go ahead and cut this right here. They only charge a couple of dollars for shipping, whereas so many other people have uh, exorbitant shipping and handling. These guys don't. So let's see what we got. Yeah, baby. Infinite Product Solutions C36. Don't know exactly what that means, but... And this feels like... This feels very heavy. That feels like um, that feels like uh, steel. Wow, I like this. The uh, plastic here is actually two parts. They've sealed in the uh, hex wrench for this. We'll go ahead and open up this hex wrench. And I gotta get better scissors. Simple as that. <clears throat> or I gotta look at Duffy One One Two and and uh, see what he uses for knives. And we have a. Um, the thing right here, I'll read this. It says, um, Smith & Wesson M&P 1522 Slip-On Custom, Quantity 1. Love it. Now, what this is, is this has a uh, uh, one half by 28 thread uh, adapter for a Smith & Wesson. And I'm looking at it here. Looks good. You can see that it has two different parts here. I did not ask for this, but in the drawing that they showed me, they decided to put in two of these um, latch, uh, I don't even know what they call these, but these uh, tighten down against the barrel, and they're made out of brass. Uh, if you saw the previous uh, unboxing video that I did about an Infinite Product Solutions, I ordered a spare one just for the fun of it, because you never know when you're going to lose one of these things. And since it was free anyway for shipping in terms of uh, what I ordered, it was one dollar to buy one, and I was like, you know what, I can afford one dollar. But this right here, if I'm right, is properly sized, it'll be perfectly centered, and I'll be able to put my suppressor on an M&P 1522. Uh, I'll be able to shoot that. It's going to look kind of awkward, I'm sure, uh, especially with the black barrel versus a, uh, I guess this is stainless steel. Good grief. I'll have to talk to them about that and see what that is. But that looks beautiful. So normally this comes with an Infinite Product Solutions card. This one didn't come with a card for some reason. Uh, but uh, let's see here. We've got quality control looking good. So I can't wait to try this. I've got a feeling, knowing Infinite Product Solutions, if I like this a lot and if this uh, sits well on the barrel, doesn't uh, budge or anything like that, we've got just enough room inside here to support that barrel. I think that they're just going to go ahead and start. They're going to start making this. So I'm going to tell you this. Uh, Infinite Product Solutions didn't ask me to do this. I'm saying this on my own. If you own a Smith & Wesson M&P 1522 and it's a smooth barrel, uh, ask them for information about this product. Uh, if it works, they're going to they're probably going to uh, come up with this for you. Uh, I of course do not work for the company. I don't I can't commit anything for the company, but I'm telling you this looks great. You wouldn't believe how nice this feels. This feels really great. I want to say something about Infinite Product Solutions that occurred during the negotiations for this part. And I paid, um, I think I paid $60 for this. During the negotiations, they created a uh, CAD CAM drawing of some sort, very simple drawing, and they made sure that my outer dimensions and my inner dimensions were correct. I checked those dimensions as well. We discussed what was on that page. 
I made sure that you know that, that everything was right, and I felt like uh, like they were losing money by talking to me as much as they did. You know, it's hey, it it's this measurement, it's this measurement. Uh, make me one for a one half by twenty eight uh, right hand turn, and uh, tell me you know uh, tell me how much it costs and. They went through a lot of effort for this, so I really give Infinite Product Solutions some really big kudos for that. Uh, and they told me it'll take a couple of weeks. Now, I paid 60 bucks for something that you'll probably pay, let's say, 25 for. I'm making that number up, of course. But what's important here is that I got what I wanted. And it was fun to be able to do this with Infinite Product Solutions, to be able to see how much they're willing to work with you for basically what little I paid for this. They don't have this product, but they were willing to custom make it for me. So I've got a feeling that if I give you this, if I give this a good review, they're going to start uh, pumping this out. So again, if you own a Smith & Wesson MMP1522, if it's a smooth barrel at the end, uh, go ahead and stay tuned, and we'll see if they start putting this into production. I need to go ahead and shoot this bad boy. <laughs> We'll give this a test. I also happen to have a um, uh, an Infinite Product Solutions uh, muzzle brake for this that I can put on here. And I like that thought. I'll be able to use the muzzle brake and I'll be able to test it, possibly to destruction. Let's, let's admit that. We'll put that on here. We'll make sure that this actually shoots true. And if it shoots true through here, uh, and it doesn't, you know, like point the... Uh, uh, the muzzle brake in a in a uh, uh, in some sort of a cant at some sort of a vector that is not true to the barrel, then we're going to find out. It'll either you know strike this or it'll strike one of the baffles. It'll strike something probably, and we will see that possibly to destruction. You know I might lose an M and P fifteen twenty two, but I'm willing to do that to test this. So uh, I'm really happy that Infinite Product Solutions has. Um, uh, has graciously done this for me. Again, I can't tell you enough about how much we actually worked in email on this before I was comfortable and they were comfortable and they said, yep, let's go ahead and pay. And this is really this is really cool. You don't even have to write a check for them. They've got a number of different methods for you to be able to pay them, including PayPal. And uh, I, I really, I like this company a lot. So let's go ahead and see how this works out in a future video. But I like this unboxing. Again, Infinite Product Solutions sends it in the right packaging, I think. I really like how um, how effective this packaging is. This is not the first time I've seen this from Infinite Product Solutions, and I've been very pleased. It's a nice padded package, protects all the contents. Everything looks good here. The uh, quality control looks great. I know that they did some quality control before they threw this in here. So everything looks good. I'm Rob Rosenberger for Mostly 22 LR and Rit well, shoot with my finger. And remember, 22LR is real ammunition. Treat it as such. And let's give this a uh, quick wipe with an oil wipe. Just to see what everything looks like here. Actually, I'm going to do a little trick here just to make sure that the, um, the interior is nice and oiled. We're good. Excellent. 